And welcome back. Bill Cronin from Mineral Springs Brewery joins us now. And Bill, from what you've been telling us so far, I feel like Mineral Springs Brewery is really just full of stories and really just, so can you tell us just a little bit about, um, just a little bit about Mineral Springs Brewery? Yeah, we're, we opened in November 2019 just ahead of COVID, which is a story in and of itself. Yeah. But um, we kind of planted ourselves as a community gathering spot and it's become that. It's been really great. But part of that community connection is the stories that we tell. Mm. And in a few minutes I'll share a Thunderbolt IPA. Well, that's the Thunderbolt. It sounds like something everybody knows about. But Thunderbolt is actually named after Herb Josting, who was a running back for Owatonna High School in the late 20s. Ah. And famously he was known as the Owatonna Thunderbolt. So right. we, we that's love cool. that. So, you know, we, yeah. we tie all of our beers have a story. Yeah and our place has a story, but that's yeah. a good connection there. So, yeah, that's that's kind of your 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 mission is just to, have, to be able to share stories while you're there, but also have that story to talk about. It's it's a good conversation starter, really. Yeah, it, it, it makes everything a little bit more fun. Yeah, and I feel like everything is kind of, it's like really integrated, you know, within the stories of Oatana, but many of the beer names, you know, even it, like the one that comes to my head is the, the Kapl Kaplan's Kolsch, which is, of course, named after a really prominent uh, family, I want to say. Yeah, Entrepreneur. family, yep, yep, yep. very famous name in the area. We have Kaplan's mm -hmm. Woods on the south side of town, so everybody mm -hmm. knows they donated that, that land, and it's, and, it's, and it's a famous name. We, we're careful how we name, mm -hmm. we, we ask families for permission, those sure. types of things, but it, it works out great. It's, it's, it's been a lot, that's actually part of the fun of introducing a new beer is identifying the name. Yeah. yeah. All right, let's talk about what you brought today. Well, I brought, I brought a Thunderbolt IPA, mm -hmm. and I brought a Straight River IPA. I brought two IPAs because, you know, people are, Generally, in southern Minnesota, people are afraid of an IPA. Mm. It tells them something that, like, oh my gosh, that's that's harsh or that's going to be a, a rough beer. Well, mm -hmm. uh, they can be. Mm -hmm. Okay. But we found uh, our Straight River IPA, and I just shared with you the Thunderbolt. Yep. Our Straight mm -hmm. River IPA, which is within 50 feet of our building, mm -hmm. the, the Straight River itself, is one of our most popular beers. It it's very smooth, mm -hmm. and but it has a lot of bitterness but people love that beer. Mm. This yeah, is the, the Thunderbolt, uh, the ordering here. I, I probably should have given you the softer one first. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's all right. And then this, the second one, Straight River, a little bit more okay. citrusy, a okay. little bit more fruity, mm. um, a fun beer. So I also brought, um, we did a bourbon barrel porter um, this last year, aged for a year. Mm. Okay. Um, and I just brought one of the bottles because they were pretty bottles, but yeah. it's a great, we had a lot of fun with that. People mm. love this beer. It's a little bit higher end beer, a little bit a more rich experience, but we're gonna be doing, we have five barrels up in, uh, up in our storage area right now that we're gonna be bringing out in time. Yeah, we cool. talked about this, but it's a whole experience when you come to Mineral Springs. So you guys have live music all the time. You also have food trucks and tell people yeah. what else they can expect. Yeah, every week. No matter what, rain or shine, we will do trivia on Wednesday night, we'll have a live band on Saturday night, and we will do MSB Go, which is, we can't use the word bingo, so we do sure. MSB Go on, uh, on Sundays. And we're starting to introduce some other things. I have a puzzle night going tonight. Oh, um, we had our first puzzle night last month, and it was a huge hit. We had puzzle night going, and I have named that tune coming. So I'm oh. listening to these love yeah. songs. Oh. Oh. And I'm, I'm gave you some ideas. Kind of woven we? into that, so we have named that tune coming next week. But yeah. we're, we're, people want to be entertained. They want to yeah. have something to gather, and we've got mm -hmm. a place. So we'd love to have them. So where can people find you? In uh, just off of downtown, to the east of downtown, right off the river. Um, we're at 111 North Walnut. It's like there's the power plant right there, and then it's like right there. <laughs> yeah, just south of a massive development that's yeah. happening, yeah. and we're going to be a part of that development over time. Yeah. Really cool. All right, well, thank you so much, Bill, for joining us awesome. today. And thank you. We'll be right back after the break. Stay with us.